Hello everyone. In the video, we are going to cover 5 best bird feeders in the market, which are the best for you considering some unavoidable factors that you might miss out without watching this video. Here, we are going to give you an impartial review to help you out to find the best from a plenty of irrelevant products. For more info and updated pricing of the products mentioned in the video make sure to check the links in the description below. Let's start. Number 1. Our best pick is Juggle 12-ounce Hanging Hummingbird Feeder. With 8 ports, an ant moat, and a no-leak construction, this hanging blocks insect freeloaders while making it easy for birds to feed. While the moat is imperfect, and a few ants breached it during testing, it certainly limits their impact. And, since the nectar is stored beneath the feeding ports, there is no positive pressure to push droplets of sugar water out of the feeder, helping to keep wasps away. To fill or clean the feeder, simply unscrew the metal hanger, and the red lid and clear plastic nectar basin detach. It's incredibly easy to use, and the hummingbirds seem to prefer this feeder to the perky pet antique glass option. You must keep this feeder at least half full for the birds to access the nectar, meaning you have to waste 6 ounces of every batch of nectar you make. According to the National Audubon Society, you should empty and wash your feeder twice a week in hot weather and once a week when it's cooler. Luckily, if you're making your nectar with granular sugar and water, as Audubon recommends, that won't cost much. Our other concern is that the plastic construction will break down over time, especially if it's constantly exposed to UV rays. Consider setting it up in the shade to save money and keep it out of the landfill longer. This affordable feeder is easy to maintain and keeps our hummingbirds happy. Number 2. Our second best pick is Brome Squirrel Solution 200 Squirrel Proof Bird Feeder. This feeder was a favorite among our neighborhood flocks. Six seed ports serve several birds at once, and the outer metal cage offers others places to perch while they wait for an opening. When a hungry squirrel leaps onto the feeder, its weight drags the metal frame down, blocking the feeding ports and they can't chew their way in. The system works brilliantly, foiling the squirrels that tried to bedevil our tests. The inner seed containing tube also allows minimal moisture to sneak in during a rainstorm and promotes airflow thanks to perforations in the base. This helps protect the seeds from dangerous bacteria and fungus growth. It also holds a reasonable amount of seed, enough to last a day or two. During testing, we saw titmice, chickadees, and finches enjoying this feeder. Despite these attributes, there are some downsides. For starters, this is higher maintenance than most models we tested. We had to consult the manual several times during assembly, and it takes time to clean. Experts recommend washing feeders with soap and water every two weeks to avoid breeding bacteria or spreading disease. Scrubbing bird droppings off the metal cage is not our favorite task. That said, if you need a feeder that will appeal to a range of bird species while stumping squirrels, we think the challenges are worth the benefits. If you want a squirrel-proof feeder with more seed capacity, the Best Nest Heritage Farms Absolute is another good option. Number 3. Our third best pick is Woodlink Going Green Platform Bird Feeder. According to the Cornell Lab, platform feeders appeal to the widest array of seed-eating birds, and this feeder certainly convinced us. It's one of our favorite feeders to watch, attracting swirls of finches and encouraging chickadees, pine siskins, cardinals, and red-winged blackbirds to settle in for a meal. Larger birds like blue jays, red-bellied woodpeckers, and even ground feeders like doves and pigeons can also access it. Additionally, this feeder is incredibly easy to use. Just pour your seeds in and give it a quick scrub every two weeks. The tray can accommodate any type of seed, nut, or fruit you'd like. Since it's easy for the birds to see what you're offering, they seem to find this feeder and adapt to new foods faster. While we love this platform feeder, it's not perfect. The platform design exposes seeds to bird droppings more than tube feeders, and the mesh floor can only do so much to separate them from the seeds. It also collects detritus-like leaves and sticks, and there is no protection from the elements. Come rain or snow, you'll wind up with wet bird seeds. Although, the metal screen on the platform floor does help the seeds dry after a storm. Despite the large capacity, it's best to add only what you think your flock will eat in a day. 
Overall, we think the elevated bird watching experience you'll enjoy is worth the extra effort. Plus, for a durable, recycled product made in the USA, the price is hard to beat. Number 4. Our fourth best pick is more birds giant combo feeder. If you have enough bird traffic in your yard to fly through your seed supply and have a strategy to keep the squirrels at bay, like dogs in the yard or a separate protection cone, then this feeder could be a great option for you. It's a huge metal mesh tube with a divider down the middle. We used Niger seeds on one side for the finches and filled the other with black oil sunflower seeds, a favor of most species. The combination made this feeder a popular one. The mesh sides, perches at each of six ports, and small platform at the bottom provide comfortable feeding opportunities for a range of species. This attractive brown feeder was covered in feathers for much of our testing period. The unfortunate thing about the massive capacity is that it takes quite some time for the birds to eat it all. While it lasts longer, the small awning does very little to keep the seed dry in the rain, putting the seeds at a higher risk for bacteria and fungus growth. This is less of an issue in dry climates or for those who don't mind frequently clearing and cleaning the feeder. Another drawback is that squirrels love this feeder too. Although they can't chew through the metal line ports, you will need to find a way to deter them. If we didn't have to worry about rain or fluffy-tailed tree pirates, this bird's feeder would be a clear favorite. Number 5. Our fifth best pick is Perky Pet Shorty Finch Bird Feeder. Built to dispense thistle seeds, this feeder is beloved by clinging birds with small beaks, largely finches and sparrows. Since American thistle seeds threaten to invade your yard, most people use sterilized Niger seeds. They are rich in fats and oils and attract American goldfinches, juncos, siskins, indigo buntings, and red poles. The birds either cling to the metal mesh tube or perch on the bottom rim to pull the seed through with their beaks, making for a fun and fluttery bird-watching experience. The feeder is also easy to use. The lid and base unscrew from the tube for quick filling and cleaning. A cone in the center of the base makes every seed easy for birds to reach so they don't spoil. And drain holes in the platform keeps them from sitting in water. In our experience, squirrels don't care for Niger seeds, and they never accosted this feeder during testing. This is a very targeted feeder, and thus, it won't attract a wide range of bird species. In the event of light rain, the seeds soak quickly. As you fill the feeder, the smaller seeds tend to escape and can blow away in a strong wind. The hanging ring isn't rigid, making it a challenge to place on a hook, and the ring on one of the two shorty finch feeders we tested broke. On the plus side, you can unscrew the tube from the awning to fill it, leaving the awning and its annoying ring in place. The feeder itself is powder-coated metal and metal mesh, which won't degrade in the sunlight and appears to hold up well. The downside is the mesh tube is lightweight and deforms easily, so treat it with care. The Droll Yankees Onyx Finch feeder feels far more durable, but the birds didn't like it nearly as much, whereas this model makes watching finches mesmerizing, and it's reasonably priced. Make sure to check the links in the description below. That's all for this review. Feel free to share your feedback.